How you doing everyone? It's Kevin. I'm back with another video. Uh, this video is about me and Julie. And we've been getting a lot of questions. What are we doing in this house? Why are we working on this house? Do we live there now? Uh, I'm going to tell you just a little story. So about two years ago, me and Julie decided we wanted to build a new homestead. So we had a piece of property in mind, but we knew it was going to come up for a back taxes sale. So about two weeks before that sale, uh, we decided we was going to move out of the house. And you guys know, I know a lot of you know, I had some issues there at that house. Uh, so where we lived, it wasn't really that comfortable there. It wasn't where we wanted to be. So we wanted to leave. So my son asked me uh, if he could buy our house. And I said, well, sure, that would be great. I'd love for my kid to have the house that he grew up in. So he told me, he asked me if... Uh, uh, I wanted to buy his house. So I figured, why not? Me and Julie could buy this house. We figured now, we our mind was set that we was only going to be there about two weeks. Yeah, we really planned on getting that other property. Yeah, we thought we was only going to be there about two weeks. We figured we go to this back tax sale and we get this property. We could move on this property. And... Um, and what we bid on the property, we didn't think, we thought for sure we was going to get it. We're like, there's no way anybody's going to bid as much as we bid on this property. Yeah. And believe it or not, we got outbid. Yeah. We were shocked. <laughs> we got outbid on it. So we ended up staying at my boy's house. And that's where we're at today. And we're doing videos on working on this house. Um, it's a good house. Uh, we're going to do some upgrades to it. Uh, get it fixed bit, up yeah. just so you know we're gonna sell it we're gonna resell it uh, later down the road but now here's what it is we already bought another homestead me and Julie's already purchased uh, property and you guys are gonna get to see this property but I do want to tell you that we're gonna start a whole new channel now when I say a whole new channel I'm not, this channel is not going to suffer. The one you're watching, it'll still have the same videos on it all the time, just exactly like you're seeing them. I'm not going to change anything about the channel that you're watching right now. It's going to stay the same, but we're going to start a new channel. Now, we bought 9.6 acres of property, and we're going to start a homestead on it. It's going to be called the Rusty Rooster Homestead. Uh, it's just Rusty Rooster Homestead. And we're going to leave a link in the description, and I'm hoping that I could put one at the top of the page here so you guys can see. Uh, but we're going to have that channel just for that homestead. And that you're going to get to see that property when I see it. When I buy it, before I even bought it, you're going to see the exact same thing I seen when I walked onto that property. So, um, hopefully, I can get a few of you guys... Uh, to go over there and subscribe to that channel so we can get it to where we can make a little bit bigger video on it. Right now my videos can only be small because I only have a couple subscribers on it. So I can't make real big videos until I get enough subscribers on it. So we definitely need you guys to go over there, look up Rusty Rooster Homestead and subscribe for me. I really appreciate it. Okay, now for the new homestead we're definitely going to do um, we're going to do the homesteading. I mean, there's no doubt. We're going to do some gardening. We're there going to be a lot of gardening. But right now, you got to understand this is raw ground. There is nothing on it. Actually, I think there's a couple campers on there, and you're going to see in this video uh, on the new channel. You're going to see there's a couple old campers on there, and um, they're not worth anything. Uh, we do got to get them cleaned up. Uh, so there's a lot of stuff there that we have to do to just get it ready to build on it and our our I don't really want to tell you the exact I know that the size building house we're going to build is going to be small it's going to be 24 by 40 as of right now we don't have a lot of plans because we, we had a lot of plans when we went to buy the property for the back taxes yeah it's like we had one basket and we had all of our eggs in it <laughs> 
<laughs> and somebody scrambled them up. I mean, seriously, it really literally broke our yeah, heart yeah. that we lost. Because we waited on that property for like two years. Yeah, and then... two years we waited. And then I had more than enough money, I thought, to buy the property. I'm kind of glad we did lose it because we would have had nothing really to work on. We wouldn't have had enough money to even do anything with it, really, if we'd have bought it. So at that price, yeah, it was a lot of money. Yeah. So uh we're looking forward to you guys coming over and checking things out we're going to build a 24 by 40 structure i'm not going to tell you that building yet because i want to make sure it's legal to build what i want to build in my where i live i want to make sure everything's legal we got to get permits for everything it's going to be a little bit weird we got to do it we got to do it we're definitely going to build a woodshed on the property somewhere there's a lot of trees on the property that's got to be taken down so there will be a woodshed build somewhere uh, Hopefully we'll get some animals. Yeah, we'll get some animals. We want to build some kind of garage. You know me and my tools. I gotta have my tools, so we gotta do some kind of a garage on it. But anyhow, I would like for all of you guys to come over and check out the new homestead. And we are open to opinions, ideas, anything you want to throw in there to help us would be great. So. That's our story, and we're sticking to it. <laughs> now, come over, check it out, and see what you guys think. Give me your ideas. I'd love for you guys to come over. So, from me and Julie, I would like to tell you guys, thanks for watching our video. Don't forget to subscribe. Leave me thumbs up, thumbs down, or a comment if you'd like. Till next time.